MTV, you only saw 12 hours of the four months we spent in Chicago. Look, there she goes. She's walking around naked right now. She has no clothes on. She has no clothes on, Drayton, I'm telling you. We lived with cameras that caught over 3,000 hours of our every move, even when we didn't know it. See what really happened when the lights went out, the temperature rose, and the clothing got sparse. Sha -la 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 -la, oh yeah. And see what happened when we crashed through the line, separating the cast from the crew. Yeah! Never has there been anything funny. <laughs> but we warn you, we are very graphic. The real world you never saw, Chicago! The most naked person in the house is lying. No, lying, lying. Anissa, first night. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. I mean, she was. I didn't mind Anissa being naked at all. I didn't mind it. it didn't didn't make me. me mad. It just shocked me. It took a little getting used to. It. Seriously, Anissa just like walks around like that. In a robe, like like her robe open, full twat. Look, there she goes. She's walking around naked right now. She has no clothes on. She has no clothes on, Drayton, I'm telling you. Wow. Excuse me? It says you're still standing here naked as we speak. That's what I said. Oh, you saved that down there. That's good. Feel my ass. It feels harder from working out tonight. <laughs> here, butt naked while you... No! This guy just mic'd me with my ass in his face, and... It... Me being naked has allowed other people to feel a little bit more comfortable. This is my favorite thing. You, <laughs> I like old panties. I'm ashamed of my body. I'm not comfortable like this. I know. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm naked. I'm okay. Put on a mic. Put on a shirt. Shut up. Naked oh, bitches are us. Were you there that time that Anissa was refusing to get mic'd? And she was naked. And you decided, I don't have to, if I don't get dressed, I won't get mic'd because right. I have to put on your shirt. So I'll just, I'll just walk around naked all the time. And know? they literally mic'd her and taped her mic right here, <laughs> butt ass naked. Are you serious? Oh, I it's the funniest thing that. I've ever that's, seen in my life. Wait, I need my camera. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Here's Justin Time, like trying to reach around and trying not to like touch her nipples. And he's just like, <laughs> where are you going to put it? <laughs> Clip it on your nipple ring. <laughs> My whole body is gonna be bleeped out. This is what you do. <laughs> oh god! Oh god! What you got? See on TV is my naked body everywhere. Hello. I was wondering if you had a shirt that I could borrow. When people would come up and uh, ask us, you know, like, what are the cameras for? Obviously, that's a pretty legitimate question, you know, people are wondering. And usually, we just very flippantly, we'd say, you know, it's a documentary. It's a documentary for school. Do you know the real world? Um, no. These cameras are Just, I have yeah, no idea what they're doing. It's just a documentary. Though. It's just a, just a documentary for school. So what is the movie about? Just life, just living and... Like lifestyle, huh? Yes. Living in the city. Exactly. Uh, Every time people would come up to us, I'd be like, first I started saying we're shooting a porno. That's what I say too. <laughs> Is that for the real world or something? It's a porno movie, that's all. Oh, so I gotta get naked again. You wanna be in a porno? Sometimes we made up some more clever. I would always say, I'd be like, oh yeah, we're, we're on the Spice Channel. You ever watch that? That's us. Yeah. The Spice Channel? Yeah. It's for adult films. I'm not kidding. Look, look at him. Look. This is one of our girls. Look at, right here. look at him. Look at I me. You think we're, we're not, not in adult films? films? Hold on, let me see if you are. I already told her. It's like that. <laughs> guy comes up and he's like, so what are, you know, what are the cameras for? I was like, well, you know, my mom's really overprotective. I was like, have you ever seen that show, Dynasty? Do you remember the brunette that was married to JR? Yeah. That's my mom. No fucking way. That's her mom. So my best friend and I, we're on vacation and they're documenting it because it's my first vacation because we always lived in studios when I was a little kid. It sounds like we're fucking with you, but it's, really, it's a weird situation. Don't get through it. My parents are rich and they hired them. We're documenting my first vacation. Oh, that's gonna be shocking for your first vacation. Okay. And then I realized when I got home that it was Dallas, mm -hmm. that JR wasn't on Dynasty, and that I got the whole, both the stories mixed up. And just, they believed it.
good look for me. Anissa and I found some mustaches back here. Oh, that's totally, this is the bruiser. <laughs> I'm the hero. And so we started putting the mustaches on, and you were putting them here and making the uni brow. Every Italian See, woman is fine to say it's I'm like a woman unless she's natural. <laughs> you a natural woman, you don't care. <laughs> I know, that's what I do. <laughs> And Anissa proceeds to take hers and put it in her butt crack. <laughs> <laughs> no, Wayne, you haven't she heard it yet. To imitate you. <laughs> this is Kyle's ass right here. Oh my god, that's awesome. I never knew that detail of the story. Though. I know. I didn't either. Yeah, that's all right. I just um, should have put a goatee back there. <laughs> We're gonna turn this thing into one big orgy. I showered uh, one time with my friend Matt. I had just jumped out of the hot tub, decided to take a shower. I was joking around with my friend Dario and I said, why don't you jump in? Anissa and Veronica both got in. We were in the shower together, there were a total of six. You shower with the girls several times. All the time. Can I come shower? No, I can't. Let us in. No, no, Let us in. No. <laughs> I'm not. That is so funny. Harry and funny and straight out of the snow. Freeze, freeze, freeze. I know. Well, when it comes to me, Getting hit uh, with the damn cameras, it happened a couple of times. Um, first experience, it'd be the first day here, man. I ran down the steps into one and hit the, and bashed into the camera. I think I fell on the floor, too. <laughs> it was run! <laughs> oh my god! Dark tank! Wait, oh, I ran fell. into the fucking camera! Oh, Tanya had like a camera stamp on her face <laughs> for like a month. Do you ever have questions about? And she was like, ow! Ah! She was God, so mad about get it. Get away. Okay. What happened? I slammed my head in that goddamn camera. That must have felt good. Oh. Oh my God, that hurt. <laughs> You guys missed it. I took the biggest digger of my life. I mean, you saw the bruises. Like, there's no messing around with this ball. Anyway, so uh, I gotta get my mic on, but I want to finish this real quick. Um. Ah! Oh my god! Okay, okay, okay. I'm instantly bruised. Knees, elbows. Sorry. Oh, I did this spill. I'm sorry. It's okay. I think it sounded worse than it was. No, it looked bad. No, I mean, I think it looks and sounded worse than it felt. You know, you guys know me. I'm like, I'm okay, we're okay. Tanya, I'm okay, you know? I think Meanwhile, compound fracture. <laughs> I totally have compound fractures. The uh, bone, I believe, actually looks like it was coming out of my wrist. My hand. Do you want more than one? I probably need, like, 12. Thank you. Keep them coming. So Tanya gets me a bunch of ice bags, and I was like, you know, like, still. <laughs> <laughs> what did I draw? The stairs? That's kind of funny. <laughs> I have one, two, three, four, four ice packs, and you're holding one on my head. You look so cute. <laughs> you're not you I mean, so it. You need to try refresh me. Remember when we went to that place in Boston? Uh -huh. They had that huge, I forgot, um, the lobster zone. Look at this thing. I want to get that big bastard right there. That guy's kind of feisty, though. All right, I'm going to give it a shot. You guys help me out. Call out what you think. I got eight seconds. How do I look, Theo? Take you all, all the way back. What about there? Oh, shit. Oh, what the hell is that? Don't think I'm not trying again. I did it three times. 
And by the third time it was going on, I'm like, I've got this bastard. And I got it all the way around him. And then the second it started to pick up, the guy just moved out of the way. You're mine, you're mine, you're mine, you're mine, you're mine. It's perfect! Yeah. <laughs> it's a great attraction. I it love it. It's awesome. It has so many other spin-off capabilities too. Like what else could, what kind of living creatures could you put in there? Mermaids. Just like hamsters or something like that. Whips, chains. With a spear. Midgets with mullets, whatever. Camera gonna get knocked up. Like that. He don't give it a fuck. You <laughs> see his back, sir? We gotta drag him again. Why? Because he hit him with the camera, like. On purpose? Yeah, on purpose. He always does that shit. Hold up. You're not allowed to interfere. There is a wall. There is a wall there. And we sure as hell obey it, so why don't you? Mm. Oh, no, wait a minute. No, Never wait a minute. do we. We have a little something that we all like to call the line frequently crossed. Seldomly recognized. Well, often the line crossing was sort of flirtatious. And I don't just know to push the envelope. About. I'd never cross the line. Right. Take my mic off. I want to go to bed. You're not here to take it off me. Is somebody to beat the mic? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I already lost it. Hold on, my mom. Oh, shag Helen. Let Good. me go ahead and be my. Favorite. Helen's a dominatrix. Nobody knew. Yeah. Look into my eyes. I love no, you. Not late. What time? I mean, it's it's so simple. It's all worked out. We've lived with each other for like three, almost three months now. We've gotten to a point where we're very comfortable in front of each other. I run naked, and you just follow. And it's like that's the way things should be. Excuse me, but the camera wants some attention. You go to bed. I'm gonna hug Smith. I violated the wall. I think I did a pretty damn good job with that wall. You, you girls were terrible. Hold on, okay? I'm loving the cross colors right now. I'm fucking on those tough. I see you. I see the flag in the back, the circle with the C and C. The sound guy has cross colored jeans on. Those are the shit. I just had to comment on it real quick. All He's right. wearing a goddamn dicky suit. I... Dickies are my favorite. And I must tell suit. you, a jumpsuit, a suit of jump. They wear them all the time. A khaki dickies uni thing with like a little bit of elastic holding it together. I mean, it's just phenomenal. The whole thing just absolutely blows my mind. It's phenomenal. Oh my god, why are we going oh, to the no, movies? Oh no, he did it! Why are we going to the movies when we have these two, like, to harass? Entertain us. Seriously. Hey guys, do you think you could, like, get that shit out of my face? Put a mask, put a mask, put a mask. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I want to be like Richard Simmons. And one, and two. Oh, feel the burn! And Nisa is cracking the shit out of me right now. We want big, firm asses, don't we? Yeah, we're gonna work until we got those asses. <laughs> it's gonna get there. We're gonna fight for it. Yeah. I thought the worst line crossings from my perspective was watching the chicks just flirt, literally. I mean, especially this one with... I did not! Kara had quite an infatuation with Mr. Richard Kim, who was one of the directors on the show, and did not hide it even slightly. Uh, I, I don't mean, know. I don't was know where you're going. I'll be Rich, you'll be Kara. Rich and I are so happy that <laughs> you, you could come, come to our, our wedding. wedding. Well, it's tough to have a crush When the boy doesn't feel the same way you do Well, it's tough to have a crush on you. I remember the first day that she mentioned my name. I was in the control room just doing my work, typing my notes, and I heard her mention about something about the Asian director being cute. He's, He's the really cute Asian guy who's been following us around subtly. He's sexy. I think oh, I was saying really, really cute style. It was the first day that they, that they were there, and from then on it was every day she would mention something about me. Rich definitely works out. Look, he's, he's got pipes. Like, he definitely works out. Not that I've been looking. I find myself, like, oh, awkwardly, one, yeah. like, staring at him. I'll be, like, busted. I literally, I'm like, oh, I'll catch eye contact and, like, immediately look away. All right, what's our question? Let's think about it before we put our hands on it. Does Rich Kim like me? Is the real question. <laughs> That's the real, I mean, when, when you're first. Let's do him. it. Well, come on. You know, right, it's just to question. ask any questions. <laughs> I just want to kiss him. I just want to kiss him. Yeah, right. 
I will kiss him, whether it's in a year or in four months. I will kiss that toy, whether he's engaged to molest me or not. You used to say things like all the time. The thing that used to make me laugh all the time was like when you would go out and like flirt with a guy or kiss a guy or something like that. You felt like you were cheating on Rich. <laughs> You're making a joke. I did. I totally did. So, okay, now that the process is over, I mean, do you have any feelings for Kara? You tend to grow attached to the cast by watching their lives, but romantically, I can't. I just don't want to say I am looking for someone else because I'm not, but my eyes aren't closed. Okay. I'm still trying to get with Rich, and that's just like the impossible. Dude, it's like, no. I'm just kidding, I know, I can't get with Rich, I know. It's tough, so tough to crush on you. Ah, uh, Kara, could you just uh, not talk to me? It makes me uncomfortable. He doesn't really say that. What does it take to be Chris, Kyle? Well, on the superficial level, you can do certain things just like dress like him, have that like perfectly coiffed like little cone right there on the front of your head, totally cool. have a coffee, have a protein bar, that type of stuff. Any reflective surface you check yourself out in, whether it be a puddle <laughs> or a mirror, anything like you, you check pot. how you look up in here and stuff like that. Just, I didn't even act like Chris. I would become Chris. <laughs> what about you? Don't you think my chest is coming in me, so? Yeah, yeah. I'm doing a lot of chest work in the gym. Uh -huh. It looks good. Mm -hmm. Doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Looks like too. Mm -hmm. I don't pose, I try to strike folks. I come hard to get black like the boots. Can I have a large ice latte, please? So wreck them up, wreck them up some more. Let the drinks just pour until we fall on the floor. And if you're out to get blocked, what about you? And if you're out on the rip, what about you? And if you wanna catch rain, what about you? What about you? Impressive. You have um, an awesome skill to just imitate, and you imitate him really well. <laughs> <laughs> you hear that dance, huh? You look cute. Nice shoes and the glasses and the coffee. It's perfect. Nice, huh? What is that? <laughs> that is just an iced latte. Mmm. I wonder where I got it. You look good, Thanks, actually. Bro. Chris, <laughs> like, was just showering me with compliments about how he looked. And I, like, and God, then you I... look hot. No, you should just wear that. You look great. It's my costume, Toast. It was you. I, 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 gotta, I want to change. I do like a drive-by scooting of him saying that to you and being like, Chris, that's your clothes, that's your outfit, that's your attitude, that's how you walk. He's like, do I look like that? Wow, I, I look hot. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs>
me hear it again. Are you kidding me? That vibrates <laughs> like a bastard. I'll be sleeping, for example, and I'll just hear it. <laughs> Wait, is it remote? That would so good. What settings? Can I see that? Can we Ready, see hold it. Action? Watch. Okay. I went to, into Anissa's room to give her a kiss goodnight, and I was just wearing my boxes. <laughs> I heard this, like, vibrating. I was like, oh my god, that's the Espizzle. The other night, like, maybe about a week and a half ago, yeah. her vibrator, like, went crazy. All of a sudden, I hear <laughs> like, I was just hitting gears or something. It was hitting switches. I was like, what's wrong with your vibrator, girl? And she just started laughing, like. They went to first and fifth yeah. in no time. It's just like, and I loved it. The she was just rolling. Can I explain the as Mizzle? Can I explain to you guys what happened? We'll take it and put it on like my leg, right? Like just here, like over my pajama bottoms. And it's like, I was like, no way, no way is this gonna work. This can't possibly turn anyone on. Like this is just weird. And I got like really uncomfortable. I was like, uh-uh, this couldn't do it. And Anissa was like, just hold it like over your pajama bottoms, like in the area. And I was like, mm-mm. And she was like, she was like, come on, you can do it. And I was like, mm-mm. You know? So I like, you know. And I told you, I was, you know, like, no way, no way. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, I totally was just like, where where can I buy mine? Like, when's the S Bizzle sale? Like, oh, is there yeah. going this, 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 sale? this ain't gonna work. This ain't gonna work. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah. Who got the busiest in the house? Who got asked? Theo and Anissa. Hey, Theo and Anissa oh, more yeah, than I. Girls, I got a lot. Chicks, got more than you got. One and two and three and four and five. This is for my dogs. It's time to get live. Cause it's one and two and three and four and five. And look at all the freaky chicks smiling in the club and in the streets. Life ain't nothing but tricks and freaks. We'll be walking down any random street, right? We'll see a girl, you'll be like. You think I'll get one of y'all phone numbers so I can get at y'all to, you know, just to try to see who's going on? I'm not trying to be <laughs> Mr. Know. Player Matt. Matt. Theo's always a G, always a pimp. He was. Yeah. What's up, cutie? It's Theo. You never told me your name. Oh, Tina. Tina, yeah. Theo. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, you also. Yeah. Let me get your cell phone number so I can get at you so I can see what's cracking. All right, well, we can show I'm you. I'm a virgin to Chicago. <laughs> virgin to Chicago. Yeah, but by the time I leave, I want to be a veteran. I want to know everything <laughs> that cracks off. I want to know everything. Sounds good. And you two look like the type of ladies that can show me. Theo's a player. Theo thinks he's a player. I don't know. I mean, he gets his fair share. I'll give him that. He has a good game. Theo used to wake me up in the middle of the night and be like, yo, man, I got these three fine-ass girls up in the hot tub. You gotta give me a... I'd be like, what? I got girls. I got a lot. Say what? Chicks. Got more than you got. That's and right. I'm out. All right, stay up. have a good night. You too. What was what? What was that? What was what? what, was what? Oh, she was cute. She was cute. She was cute. Theo and Anissa probably pulled a lot of, they both probably collectively got a lot of females, but they kept it out of the house so right. much. They were really good about it, and I... <laughs> so were you. And you would be like, we just go back to my place. Completely shh, hush, hush. She's a tetris, that queen of tears. She'll bring you down onto your knees. She's a tetris, she'll bring you down onto your knees. No, Theo and Anissa, I mean, they were all about women, both of them, mm. and... They got a lot of behind-the-scenes ass. Mm -hmm. My ass seems to all be on television. Nevin is just a word. It basically means never to the 10th power. I love Nevin. I love Nevin. I'm starting to say it all the time, yeah, now. Really I'm like Nevin Nevin. Nevin. It took us about two days for Nevin right. to circulate. Nevin can she return. <laughs> Nevin. Oh, major cheeks and Nevin Nevin gonna happen. I'm Nevin I'm Evan, am I gonna be able to put this in my mouth? Nevin is their gas cap on that. Right? Nevin is? Nevin. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I was talking to the R dub line. They're like, you guys have like your own, yeah. They're like, you guys have your own language. I'm like, we kinda do. Oh, it's just a mild case of stomatic, stomatic. It's just a hole in your throat. You breathe from it.
stomatic junction. But let's explain. Of the let's throat. explain. The reason that the joke even started is because in our lifeguard training, the um, we were learning about you know um, mouth to mouth and you know resuscitation, and um, we, they, they they were like explaining that like. God forbid you got like a mouth to stoma or <laughs> like a victim, a stoma victim who's drowning. If anybody has a stoma and they're drowning, they can drown because I will not blow in someone's neck. I always envision running up to some person who's collapsed, <laughs> who can't breathe. And I'm like, okay, I need, I need to help this person. And I get down, I'm like, ah, oh, Christ, I got the guy with the stoma. I, I hate doing mouth to stoma. Why can't this guy just breathe? Breathe through the stoma. Breathe through the mouth, breathe through the stoma. <laughs> I think I just pulled a muscle in my stoma oblongata, okay? Don't burst your stomatic valve. I'm going to rush you to the hospital. Stomatic's anonymous, anonymous. Night for a stoma net. We, uh, we named, um, I'm gonna kill that dude. not one of our fish, but our one and only eel. We he named him Stoma. Night. I had a strong attachment to our fish, and like within the first three weeks, they dropped. Crookshank's like, Eight bad shrimp. Look how skinny he is, huh? He's, he just told me that. We just, I, I mean, can you guys save him and bring him back? He's gonna die in here for sure. So I'm gonna my take, him take, take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Check him back, and we'll see if we can get him back in the quarantine system. I know system. CPR. I will go in there. So just go, go away, cause I never wanna know. Oh, Pasha. Pasha Lexington, the drag queen fish. She was a, a great fish. Hey, there's a memorial service for Pasha Lexington going on right now. No, Pasha! Her wig fried and she didn't know what to do. Tell us, tell to hold on, we're flushing Pasha. Look how beautiful I she was. I remember the first time you put on that Gucci dress. You look so cute, girl. I know, she did. She did. Say Those bye. fake titties. She brought me that wig that day. I may not have liked mm -hmm. it, but I, it was thought that kept. All right, Pasha. To Pasha yeah. No! Why? It's so hard to say goodbye. Who's the worst dancer? In the Chicago Sun Times said that I couldn't dance my way out of the box. box. I think Kyle and Chris are the worst dancers. I'm sorry. That's fine. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> I, I, get the, I get my white boy thing going out there on the dance floor. I don't, you do. I'm not, you know, I'm not friggin' Michael Flatley, but you know, I'm, I don't need to do the African anger ritual when I walk out there. Chris kind of does this dance where he's just, he, right. he dances like he's modeling. He's got this real serious game face on. He's just like, he does this, all the shoulder thing. He's, he's actually like, his body's kind of tricking the rhythm, and his ass. Yeah, it does all on shoulders. beat, which is like he's dancing to the beat, but Wait, then his body's like doing this. I think everybody has rhythm in the house. I do more than big pimping. I count cash. Just saw this back with the funk at your girl shaking it fast. <laughs> Fellas, grab it fast. Please grab it for me. Cause when I'm in the club, I'm representing the D. You see, I hate girls that act so good. Hey, what's up, girl? Show me some love in the club. Oh, oh, shut, shut up. Suck up. Trick. Oh, well, I guess it's your loss. Don't want to ride with a brother. Just knowing the boss. I'm boss. Usually, it's the mic in. Help us, my dogs. No, yeah, I'm mic in too. But I ain't stuck up like you. So you think you got more cash than me? Yeah, you got more back than my reach. My watch is flashing. Girl, let's do that nasty. Ride it, baby. Let's ride it, girl. Anissa and Theo, you're basically having sex. Anissa's just like Anissa doing just these erotic things. Anissa just uses her butt. Ride it, baby. Let's ride it, girl. She licks her lips. She touches her boobs. Um, you, you and I are the best dancers. Oh. 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 This message is for Tanya. Tanya, this is Justin. This, this message, message is for Tanya. Tanya, Tanya this, this is Justin. Justin. Hey, babe. <laughs> <laughs> this message is for Tanya. Tanya, 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 Tanya. We did like a remix of the, uh, the, vo the voicemail. <laughs> this message is for Tanya. Hey, babe, it's Justin. The message is Justin, Justin. It's message for Tanya, Tanya. And we just started this free form, like, rap screaming thing where it was just like a lot of terms where <laughs> it was amazing. Kidney stones and kidney stones and not on the trip and not on the trip and Justin's coming, Justin's coming. I can't go and I can't go. Kidney stones and kidney stones and I can't go. I can't go. How do I never knew about this? Because it was just something small. It was cute. Wow, wow, I can't be so 
checking the messages. Um, usually there's, I mean, you guys know there's like, they'll, they'll literally be like, you have 49 <laughs> unheard messages. And you're like, 123 oh. <laughs> saved messages. Nevin did I get my messages. That's a lot you of left why a, I, I spent Did you know how to use the phone system? No. You never, you never checked your messages once. I don't even know the code. I didn't know how to access our messages. One, two, three, four. Tanya, I think, will we'll hear a big word and then try to use it and often uses it incorrectly, which kills me because if you don't know the meaning of a word, don't use it. Uh, that's the one thing that I love about Justin is his, just his demeanor with people and the way he handles cabs. Mm -hmm. And like, I'm frustrated and he's mm -hmm. kosher. And mm -hmm. and the other thing that I noticed about Jason last did night... Did you just say kosher? That shirt's kosher. Oh my god, kosher. thank like you, that. thank you. I've been working on it. Your pants are very kosher. Yeah, I'm like, you mean they don't mix the meat and the cheese? Hope you don't break your toe or get sick because you are financially not covered by Bill Murray Productions, period. The greatest time of story ever occurred in the first week. She knew where the chic had come from, Walla Walla, and was now in Chicago. And uh, she looked at the United States map, and first of all, couldn't tell me where Chicago was located. Good story. End of story, no. I decided in my kind of playful way to have a little fun with Tanya. And I'm like, oh, well, Tanya, you know what? It's right there. She's like, oh my god, I can't believe it's that far south. And I'm pointing to southwestern Texas, which she completely believes is Chicago. And she's like, hey, let's go to Mexico. We're so close. You know, let's just walk over there. So before we start, head east on West North Avenue. Which one's east? I wish we wanted those. East is this way. Is it? Because east towards... North, south, east, west. In, east is this way. How do you know that north is this way? Have you ever seen the compass? North, south, east, west. East is, yeah. Um, Tanya was on Chris's bed, I was with Carrie on Carrie's bed, and we were all like eating like donuts or something like chocolate or whatever, and Tanya was like, oh, Chris would be mortified if he knew I was eating on his bed. Do you know how mortified Chris would be if he knew I was just eating in his bed? Bitch, he will not be embarrassed that you on his bed eating. He will be angry as a mug. Exactly, exactly. She says, um, 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 don't put all your rocks in one basket. And I have put all my rocks in one stone, in one basket. Babe. I put all my rocks, rocks in, in, your you, in your basket. Jippy, you know, I was out shopping for Halloween cards, and right before I, I checked out, there was this little small hand that said, you know, if you add water, it'll grow like 15 times the size. Who the hell are you? How big is it? It's not very big, because it's not as big as my hand, and my hand's pretty small. Do you think it'll get bigger? No. It's pretty weird, isn't it? I, don't want I gotta hand it to you. It's uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Hands down. Hands down. It's uh. <laughs> High five. Oh, give it up. Straight in. Bag. Oh. Oh, you <laughs> bitch. This is my new makeup. That's disgusting. You threw it out. When you guys were on vacation, I. You didn't feed it. Jiffy shrivel. I remember cleaning the whole kitchen, and then I looked over, and both Karen and I were like, "Ew." That's Jiffy, man. Their power to overwhelm and destroy. Anissa, just the way that she talks. Hi, how you doing, Otto? I just put my purple panties right here, big fella. I'm not a chicken head, so I understand. <laughs> <laughs> the imitations, that, that, she's, not imi she's not imitating anyone. She's doing her own original. Right, like, so like take clues from It's voices. Mary. And that fat girl, I had to maneuver <laughs> around her particles because it was so big <laughs> and so hefty. <laughs> that I couldn't hold it all by myself. <laughs> Rashid, I'm here to tell you that I'm all day in a bag of chips and you ain't shit. <laughs> bad. Yo mama fat. <laughs> you don't talk about that bitch. Shut the fuck up. I'll smack the shit out of you. I'll smack this shit. I ain't afraid of you. I got a lot of meat behind this. Hi, I'm Jack. Hi, I'm Margaret. What nice is it? Nice to meet you, yes. Don't act like you ain't met me before. Um, like we've Todd, never been here Todd, 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 You're just using that your Todd? original position on your knees, bitch. Todd, I, Under grew, my away, I grew those knee pads away a long yeah. time ago. Titi, titi. Titi. Titi is too small for me. Look at my butt. It hangs out of my panties. <laughs> Maybe if you could buy me some panties at DJ Maxx, I'm size six. You could buy me another pair. Normally I don't wear panties, but today I'm feeling like I should be wearing panties. Purple panties for you, big man. <laughs> Orlando. He'd be like, look, man, you all need to clean up after yourself. You know, just limpia la casa whenever you can. Orlando was more of like 
he was the lifeguard at the pool right. that we worked at, and he was interesting. You have to clean it off. It's just gonna swell up and get purple. You know the rest. He thought Chris was so cute, but Chris doesn't have a butt, and he likes a butt with a man. And um, he became this kind of caricature with Anissa. I like men with shaved ass and like all spread it, it's all this ass. Chris has no ass, I like to spread it. I, with Chris, he just bend over and it's just huevos, you pinch on. He honestly said that he, he, honestly said that he wanted to spread Chris's cheeks and toss that Caesar salad, bitch. <laughs> Anissa definitely gets the gold medal for the dirtiest mouth in the house, but I think there's like four, maybe three or four silver medals that we all share. Yeah, I, I agree. Because we are not a clean group. I would yeah. say that 99.9% 99% of the conversation was about sex, and, they, and then the other percent was about going to the bathroom. I just farted on the toilet for 25 minutes and produced a turd that big. <laughs> you farted? Chris, you just fart? Nice. Oh, I, I definitely thought he blew his nose. Well, that was for all the people that can't fart somewhere else. <laughs> Did you shit on the floor too? God, I would walk up and Denise would be deucing in the freaking bathroom with the door wide open. She'd be like, Carrie, come here. Ah, She'd be no. like, you guys, I want to tell you something. And you're like, I'd start Not sucking now. my thumb. I'd curl up in a ball in the fetal position, but I'd make sure that I shut the door first. Wait. I'm in here looking at pictures. I have a question. You're yes. on the shitter. I thought you had a problem with this. No, I don't care anymore. I think I'm done. I'm just going to sit here and relax. <laughs> Ew! Oh, oh my God. God! Some of my greatest conversations were with Anissa Bad while terrible. she was dropping the deuce. She'd be talking to me and on the toilet. Yeah, so today I talked to, to you know, <laughs> and, uh, you know, everything is going all right. I know it's gross, but I have a fetish of like picking at things. Like I think it's fun to pick at things. Like just like nails. Yeah, so we decided to get together one night and pop Kyle's zits on his back. It's ah. Oh, did you get it? You just farted. Oh, I squirted. What was oh, it? Oh, please bag. let me get the next one. Let me see it. Let me see Wait, it. no. Oh! No, wait, let me look. Here you go. Here you go. I got one. love it. Let me look at your bag. Do you have any? Ah! <laughs> I don't think I can see it. Just make him bleed. Look. That means it was a good one. Uh, it was a the red badge of courage. It was a total order. squirter. Look at that. If I would have done it in front of the mirror, it would have hit the mirror. Oh, that's great. Right. Ah. Oh, I'm getting that one. Check this out. Oh, Watch this. Wow, this this is, you cannot move. You cannot move. Do not move. Do not move. <laughs> He's all getting good shots. I've shot. never had a group <laughs> popping before. Look at this one. Ah. Oh, what? Yeah. Y'all yeah. women are enjoying that a little too much. I freaking love it. I love popping things. Do I got any right now, you guys? Not really. We could make some. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty good. Ow. I like that there's still like scars from us. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the offer though, man. No problem. <laughs>
Why? Well, you use this like really scary voice and you put on this mask. This mask, that mask is really scary. I just want to sleep with Kara tonight. And it just, I didn't see Kylo under it. I just saw you and I like, it really, it, it freaked me out. Let's see what's under my dress. No! <laughs> Nevin! I want you guys to enlighten me with your theories. What did Tanya do in this house when we were in New England? <laughs> While you guys were gone for the first couple of days, I was supposed to kind of lay low, and so I spent a lot of time in bed, and like, Justin was here, and so we'd hang out, but we didn't do anything. The way you, you look when, when you bounce up and down Makes me want to jump and scream and make a lot of sound I don't know how you learn how to give it to me so good Tanya's probably pretty bored. I, I think Tanya shagged like a minx. I've never had a kidney problem, but I would think on the list of kidney don'ts, like maybe the top three are avoid rigorous exercise, excessive drinking, and sex? excessive sex. Exactly. I'm gonna go like ahead that. and say, <laughs> 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 right. Every decision Tanya made made no, no sense to me at all. Tanya was fresh out of the hospital, and I guess when she misses out a lot and, or she misses experiences, she likes to go out and jump right into them. I think she was just kind of looking maybe to get drunk with us. So she goes, probably has like several glasses of wine, doing shots, just a lot of drinking. Yeah. Elevator downstairs. What is all this? I don't know. I'm gonna it's go vomit, ahead. actually. It's def that's vomit right there. Uh, I've never seen it. That's that's vomit too. That's oh, a little bit fuck. of sushi right there. It looks like some yes, uh, yeah. Yeah, tuna. Yeah, sushi. Look, Everybody step over the tuna roll. There is vomit all over the lobby. There was actually an entire piece of sushi. Yeah, I <laughs> I actually ended up that's I ended up sushi. cleaning the sushi and I'm sitting there like mopping it up and oh, you know you know there's some fresh it. sake <laughs> and there's a California roll. Didn't like that one too much. You know it was, it was like it, a full, full up rice piece with like a tuna <laughs> on top. It was like an seaweed. entire roll. It was like a murder scene where you come in and like you get closer to the body and there's like a blood trail. We had like a sushi sushi trail coming into the house. We'll leave bad minutes the back cave. Yeah, see you later. Oh, okay, here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Kenny. Huda! Hi, guys. What the? <laughs> What's going on? We're sleeping. This is where you guys live? <laughs> you found us, dude. <laughs> it's the darkest, deepest little corner ever. This is the bathroom. This, this is our home. This is where the bathroom rings right here? Yeah. yeah. I thought this was going to be nice or something. Yeah, we got through? This is a low rent production, man. This is not like <laughs> survival. Hey, are we bathroom like... someone sitting here it's right there. in this right room? Right there. Right there. Totally. On a piece of shit lawn chair? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's Theo's bed. Where are your roommates? Upstairs, I guess. Well, since you busted in, you might as well bring everybody yeah, yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. I don't get fucking ready to get him. Hey, you guys! You guys, I just saw this very shocking. It's horrible. What the fuck? enjoyed the footage that was left on the cutting room floor. I hope you enjoyed the footage you... What was it again? I hope that you guys have enjoyed the footage we left on the cutting room floor. 
Thanks for watching The Real World Chicago. Thanks for watching The Real World Chicago. You've never seen Oh, The Real World. <laughs> Say the line again, I'm sorry. Thanks for watching The Real World You Never Saw Chicago. Thanks for watching The Real World You Never Seen Chicago. <laughs>